Hi folks, and welcome to my first game in this league season. They're gonna be playing versus Lemon Spawn, and yeah, some of you might have noticed that it is a B league, and actually I was uh, uh, last season I was playing in C, and I didn't finish uh, first. I finished second, but I got a free promotion, which is not that satisfying as uh, finishing first, but whatever, I'll take it. Anyway, uh, here's the first board. We're playing rated this time because Lemon Spawn wanted to do that. Um. <laughs> and he, he's been nice in the chat. Anyway, uh, what's going on here? Uh, yeah, here's the, here's the, the board. And um, right, <clears throat> so uh, do I have, uh, do I have um, you know, uni for gain if you want that? Away of the wolf draw it goes nicely with Willa, it goes really nice with Willa. Uh, might want uh, to do a skulk, yeah, skulk goes nice with way of the wolf too. I think I want to wear a Skulk Bonfire, how about that? Let's do that. So, um, Estate's gonna be annoying. In fact, ah, ah, in fact, I wonder, maybe, maybe, oh my god, it might be a transmute board. It might be, it might be, it would still require a very specific set of circumstances, which will probably never happen. Uh, all right, do I, uh, uh, what am I, what am I supposed to, how am I supposed to play this? So I can, I can attack him with a skulk, then buy a wheel and draw, well, uh, yeah, and I still gonna have an extra buy. So uh, will I hit enough money uh, in this case? I think I will. Uh, how much money do I still have uh, in the deck? Uh, I have five. Uh, yeah, and I can buy a potion. So let's attack him. Famine, uh, well, that did nothing. All right. Let's get a potion now. There should be another uh, Willa for sure. Um, yeah, still draw. Oh, I have zero buys now. God damn it! <laughs> I needed to. I needed to find the skulk. Yep. Well, I think I'm gonna keep doing this uh, weird kind of stuff. Because why not? And yes, well, that does nothing to him, sadly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy those villas. Uh, do I need to... I'm fine. So uni is obviously good. I can also, <laughs> uh, you know, whatever, whatever. I'm I'm doing it because I, I I think it's probably wrong, but it's just when else when else I I'm going to do that? You know, getting a transmute. Because, okay, the uh, thing is, I mean, obviously, uh, if you are smart, you just take a uni, or maybe you skip potion altogether. I'm, I'm not even sure. But the thing is, transmute actually will allow you to kill those estates, and, you know, they're going to get in the way. 
uh, with the way of the whole and the way uh, Willa works and Haunted Woods. So, and golds are good here. So, thing is, Transmute isn't that bad as usual here. It's probably still bad. I mean, let's be honest about that. I think I play both and buy another Willa here. All right. Another one, I think. We need to draw more. And this one will just play normally. I like having those goals. So yeah, I mean, so far, somehow, this transmute isn't all that bad. Uh, I guess it's just a uni here. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> but yeah, it, it definitely feels nice to have transmute in the deck. <laughs> Without Swindler on the board or anything like that. I wonder if he takes one now. Like, transmute Bonfire. I bet he does. <laughs> yeah. Nice. <laughs> mm. Well, I'm not quite sure. I, th I think... I think here, though, I'm gonna... Well, that's slightly unfortunate. I kind of want to kill an estate this turn. That would be nice. Uh, let's do it this way, maybe. Ah, uh, looks fine. So, do it like that. Kill this estate. Now, you need four. I think we need uh, Haunted Woods now. Um, is that even true? Mm. See, it's gonna be. I think you want a couple of haunted woods, and um, let's just play the. Uh, let's just play the skulk to maybe cause some damage. Well, curse is curse is annoying, so that was a nice one. Now here I can buy another Willa and something else. Let's do that. So I can buy Uni and uh, another Willa. I think that's uh, that's good. And play the Hundred Woods. Uh, should I take the last Willa here? Uh, I could uh, take another Skulk and then Bonfire. I think I like it. So, get the Willa, draw, attack. Alright, so uh, it might be just bonfire. We don't have uh, Willas anymore to help with the draw. Uh, yeah, let's. Maybe it's. I mean, wh what am I even doing now? I have two unis. I'm gonna have a bunch of gold. I should think about greening pretty soon. Yeah, let's just get rid of coppers. I think I have um, enough gaining power now. Just don't want to, you know, not draw somehow. So uh, 
As hundred woods might still annoy him this turn. And obviously lack of uh will so you can still you can still do away with the owl, but <clears throat> you can't hide your treasures anymore. So that yeah, that's something. Definitely wanna get rid of this coppers and wanna get some more uh, traditional draw now. Uh you can play the transmute as intended, so that's also good. Has two curses now. <clears throat> I have all the golds. I mean, golds, you know, you still need to draw those golds, but I think I'm so, uh, like, this turn I'm probably still... Well, actually, I don't know. All right, <laughs> doesn't matter. Hail transmute. Yay. All right. <laughs> I like this one. Uh, Alright, GG. And there we go with uh, with another one. Here's the board. <clears throat> uh, what's up with this druid? This druid is uh, rather uninspiring, but well. Uh, what's up with Fortress? Nothing really. Yeah. <clears throat> um. Yeah. So it kind of looks like uh, it looks like money to me. Um, I'd say you still want a chip all. Like chip all. Maybe chip all star chart, but. Or just chip all gear. Then you get the treasure trove and counterfeit and just go. Something like that. Alright, that's fine. Hopefully my gear won't miss. He's got the the best draw because uh, next turn uh, he'll trash all these dates, which is obviously a big deal, but. Oh my goodness, that that's not good. I I need to get a silver. Oh wait a second, what what happened? Uh, all right, I'll think about it later. But yeah, that why why wouldn't he set aside some states the last turn? That's really weird. All right, I'll just take a silver here. <clears throat> All right. Uh, should that just be a counterfeit already or treasure? I mean, treasure trophy already or counterfeit first? Ah, give me the trove. And I'll get counterfeit this turn. So, it looks decent to me. I mean, I'm a second player, but I do have this trove already. <clears throat> and I'm gonna get the counterfeit this turn. So I feel like I'm in a pretty good shape. I meant, uh, well, there is a choice here. Whether I should uh, kill this, uh, kill all my states or leave one. Takes counterfeit first. Uh, 
I think I just kill all. We're gonna have a plus bar. <clears throat> that's uh well it's a pity I did not uh, haven't uh, haven't found any of my terminals here I don't think not not getting uh, not not going the trove way is, uh, is an option here at all I think you just go for that and here, so what if I just trash the copper? It's gonna be uh, nine, and the buy. What if I trash the silver? Something tells me it's gonna be ten and the buy. Hmm, he wants to build like that. I mean, to what end? Hmm. And I can also kill the gold and have 11 and the buy for... Like bronze star chart. Bronze... Uh, what will Bruins star chart allow me to do? Uh, does it uh, does it give me a Bruins the next turn? So I'm playing. I can. Uh, I can on top deck a silver. So it's going to be basically it's going to be silver copper, right? Uh, what do I have in, the, in this next hand? Uh, two action cards, a trove, and. Two coppers, so it's four, five, six, seven. No, it ain't. It ain't a bronze. So I don't think I want to bronze this turn. All right, I need to build just a little bit longer. Uh, so another trove counterfeit looks probably the best. Let's, let's do it this way. Sadly, this turn. I'm quite unlikely to uh, uh, to buy a prize. Maybe I should maybe I should have been trying to. Uh, you know what? I should have been getting a star chart. Yeah, that was bad because star chart star chart a previous turn would guarantee me a prize this turn. I should have been getting like another trove and star chart or another counterfeit and star chart something like that. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because now I feel like, um, yeah, obviously there is a way of the camel, so uh, maybe maybe that's why you don't get the trove. All right, can I can I hit it here? That's yeah. Happily gonna do that. Run star shirt or something. He's gonna be able to. Well, still, I think you won the trove. Now I think he needs to go for green. Although I'm gonna have more money, I might just. Uh, yeah, it might it might be hard for him to compete without the trove. Because even with the way of the camel, he still needs to buy a gold once in a while to replenish uh, 
his supplies if he's going to counterfeit the gold. And if he won't do that, I mean, my deck is just better. Uh, is that true? Uh, what? Whatever. I'll shut up and uh, we'll see what happens. <clears throat> It's funny, for, for his deck right now, Star Shard probably isn't all that important because it's just way too small. And for my deck, Star Shard at this point isn't all that important because my deck is just uh, quite large at this point. And I just, uh, I will just benefit from it, um, you know, uh, way too infrequent. Gets a grip. I, I don't like that. Ew. I mean, crypt and trove. All right. Um, I'm sure. Uh, kill the copper, kill the gold. How oh, much money is that? That's uh, three. That's seven. That's you know, twelve. Well, I can do. I can do pro and star chart. I mean, I can also just get a bronze and keep the gold. I think I want the star shot rather. All right. That's another one of these. Thing is, he might be building a nice deck there, but I, I don't think he, he'll be able to outscore me. Yeah, I mean, is he? I don't think he'll be able to double press this turn. So I get one this turn. So there are five on the supply. Let's say, he, well, he probably takes one this turn, right? Oh, actually, it's quite close, huh? Mm, maybe, maybe, maybe he's just killing me here. I don't know. Thing is, I mean, what if he doubles the next turn? And what does this creep do? I he doesn't even want to set. Uh, all the all the money aside, right? All right. Uh, surely gold on top. Yeah. Well, that I mean that's bad. Oh no, he's going to double, and then he's probably going to double again. Yeah, I just lose. I mean. Well, maybe he can double this turn. Uh, he's likely to, I would think. Yep. I mean, it's not impossible for me to double next turn if I find my gear, both my counterfeits and like all my all my golds. Kill 
Those are gold. Uh, let's pronounce Dashi. All right. I'll get my Dashi here. Uh, that's surprise. So I should do that. But mm, yeah, yeah, he's he's winning here sadly. Uh, I guess I underestimated building here. I guess this turn. Uh, I I'm not quite sure about the crypt still, but uh, uh, going a little bit thinner and then adding some additional draw. Uh, kinda was was good enough to catch up. Apparently, I know. I mean, I could have been drawing uh, a Brian's hand the last turn. That would have been different. But um, I had no way of gu guaranteeing that. So that's why you don't play money when you when you can avoid it. Uh, you have more control. So I can't really complain here. But I mean, let's let's see what. Mm, the problem is, yeah, he still has another card down on the uh, two uh, two cards there on the on the crypt. He set aside two with the gear. And I'll happily take a tie. Trash is what? Well, I mean, all right. He's likely he's likely to double here. Obviously, I just need to. I just need to take a bronze. I mean, I have no other options really. And uh, that is terrible, though. That's really not good. Yeah, I mean, well played. All right. Uh, it's fine. Just a money game, huh? Mm, another chapel board. Kingdom. Uh, all right. So, um, what's going on here? Uh, what split did I get uh, for four? Yeah. Mm, which well, I guess you just buy chapel with the uh, with the next one, so so good. Mm. We have we have trove again. I don't have any plus buy again. <laughs> Actually. Uh, those boards are not all that different, right? Uh, yeah. So I guess you don't really care about the terminals here. You don't really care about the villages here. I think it's just Caravan Chapel. You can go Silver Chapel, but I think it's just Caravan for some additional draw and then you take a trove then you take a couple of storytellers and you know just do it this way don't really need a sewer because you have this cursed gold I think I mean might be trashing it at some point But um, I'd certainly use it to spike the first five. All right, it's f it's good to see the caravan here at least. Takes a trove right away. Uh, that sucks. Yeah. Yeah, that is not good. That is. Pretty terrible, actually. Uh, I think I'll I'll go ahead and grab the silver. Mm. 
Uh, he still he still can have a pretty bad draw here. Like actually, that is that's already not. Well, uh, no, that that actually was a decent draw. I mean, he's getting quite quite some curses, but. I can't just trash here, yeah, I need to... Uh, what am I... what am I even buying first here? It's the settlers... Uh, I mean... Yeah, I guess I'm gonna take those. That's definitely getting a bit more curses than I wanted, but I'm gonna take one more here. And Caron missed, and Settlers won't do anything at all. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like this not exactly going my way, um, but we'll see. I think he should just take a second story dollar. Gets a puka, really. All right, hey, we might be able to actually. Well, obviously that's not great. Oh, I didn't draw the chapel. Uh, I think I need a second storyteller. And please draw me one. A chapel, a uh, caravan. Please draw me a storyteller. If I, if I draw a storyteller here, I'm actually in a pretty damn good shape. Uh, but I didn't. Uh, Alright. He does what? He just trashes. He he took some he took some bath points. Do I kill this stupid cursed gold now? I don't think I don't I don't see a reason to. I should just take a third story dollar, I think. And hopefully gonna draw everything this turn and you know. But no bath for me, sadly. And I'm definitely he get Takes the barracks. I mean, yeah, he takes this. He, he has the puka now, so that's why he does that. Um, uh, how many cards are there? Oh, wait, I guess I know. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, well, now it's more. I don't have a story dollar down there as well. Alright, what's the last card? It's curse, right? So I want to draw it. Now that's definitely a prize for me. Do I kill the cursed gold? Uh, I think I do not. Just kill the coppers. Um, maybe I should have been leaving one. Uh, yeah, that was probably a mistake. Whatever, get the bronze. Okay, that's that's good. I need him to miss the province here. I need him to somehow not be able to buy a province here. I, but the problem is it's kind of impossible. He he's gonna he's gonna buy one and then he's gonna buy one next turn and then he's just ahead. So that's not good. One, two, 
three. Um, play the trove here. And um, we chip all. Uh, wait a second. Those and bronze. Yeah, he gets there. Oh, don't give me that. All right, we are fine. Maybe he, maybe he can draw. I mean, uh, he only has a story. That, well, he has this book, all right. If he misses, if he misses a branch now, I am in a good shape. But um, yeah, he ain't gonna. You're gonna get there. I mean, I need. I would need to buy a promise for sure, right? Hmm. Yeah, obviously he's drawing everything. I don't... I mean, I don't really even like the puka here, really. I think you, because you know, it takes it takes a turn to buy the puka. It takes a turn to buy the barracks. Why not just get a couple of story dollars? And um, they sound more flexible, I'd say. But yeah, I feel like um, I, I I didn't even. I didn't even feel like there was a moment for me to take any important decision, I, I don't think. Mm, uh, so yeah, I kind of think that it mostly was the early draws that, that were slightly different. I mean, we had different openings, right? Um, he was able to get the trove, I didn't get the 5 on my opening. So um, maybe Caravan was not, just not the very best. Uh, thing to open with. All right, drew a bronze, which is actually not all that bad. Uh, I mean, there is no reason for me to just go ahead and take a dash, so I gotta, uh, yeah, take the bronze and hope that he can't buy a bronze. But yeah, he will buy a bronze here for sure. Uh, that was an that was a slightly annoying one. Because I, I mean, I don't, I don't know. I, I feel like, uh, yeah, there was not the whole lot of stuff to do here. All right. <clears throat> Hopefully the next. So, uh, at the start of this one, Lemon Spawn asked me if uh, I'm okay to play with the liked list on, and I agreed. Uh, I hope he doesn't have treasure trove on his liked list. Uh, he does not. All right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you played the first three quite quite fast, and I've lost uh, two of those. So that's number four. And here's the board. Uh, uh, Campments. Um, have pools. Actually, even if I lose like all the rest of the games in this first transmute board, worth it. <laughs> anyway, let's actually not lose all the rest of the boards and try to win some. And um, uh, how to trash here with a loan? Ew. Uh, you you can't you can't trash the states. 
Uh, that's actually somewhat annoying. You probably do want the loan. Hmm. Do you get the pools here? I think you are supposed to. I think. I think you do get the loan. You do get the pools, and you do get a lot of farmers markets. Because our villages are cheap. So those gonna be good. You can also scepter them. What about improve? Uh, it ain't great here, I don't think, because we don't really have any four costs, so yeah, it's kind of, you can turn your, like, if for some reason you're going to have, like, a Settlers or a Pawn, you can turn it into, uh, I don't know, a Willish or a Farmer's Market, but um, you don't want to improve your encampments, and uh, each chance you're going to have to buy two costs, you're going to probably buy encampments. I mean, as long as they're still there, anyways. They're gonna be there, right? Because getting the gold is gonna be annoying. I guess you might get one at some point. So, uh, rebels are fine, probably. But uh, actually, a rebel is going to kill the piazza eventually. He just gets a potion. I. I mean, thing is, <laughs> lone potion is not the you know the very ex the the most exciting opening in the world on the other hand what else are you getting here uh, yeah I, I think i pretty much agree okay that's that's good at least you know the bad stuff oh my god would you look at that hopefully he doesn't have a potion in this end because then it's just super good for him otherwise it's still plenty good but you know not not the crazy good thing. Oh, I can still draw very nicely if uh, gets a rebel. Oh, all right, whatever. Oh, fuck off. Uh, <clears throat> scout. That's that's your I I don't I don't really care about this rebel all that much. This sucks, obviously, and so I don't have a, an ugly ugly estate there i would buy f well I, i'm not even sure about the farms I, I guess pawn is fine yeah and whatever i said earlier about the campus i i'd rather have the pawn now actually let's scout one two three get this pawn tom dex in the state that's that's wherever actually that was fr friendly rebel Discard that, you can keep the copper. Discard that and do like that. And through the estate, that's annoying. Uh, what is it? Card by. Ah, dude, through the estate. Now that ain't good. Uh, Alright, pool. Yeah, I mean those states obviously they always gonna be annoying here. They they always gonna be with you. They they gonna haunt you through this whole game. Uh, 
All right, we're gonna. I guess I discard your loan. Uh, I ain't gonna. That's pretty damn bad. Mm, farms market already. Should I get just another bone? Yeah, n not not going to exactly great here, to be honest. Hmm. both have three pools I think so I guess you just never buy the settlers on this board right Pretty useless. All right, drawing something. All right, we're still drawing. Um, discard that, don't deck that. Uh, buy corn. Well, playing this loan is a little bit. Uh, it's terribly bad. That's what it is. Uh, I, I should probably scout now. Yeah, I mean... Alright. Oh, that's, that's fine. Might think about getting a gold, because you know, you can gain encampments then. It's not like, well, I mean, I guess uh, pools are almost gone. Rebel, um, Rebel is a little bit too terminal, right, to get in quantities. Oh my god, what is this garbage? Oh boy. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can... I and mean, what am I supposed to do here? It's just... Uh, I'm just not... Did he discard all my good cards or the last turn or something? He discarded a pool and then another pool with the rebel. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it is annoying. Because um, now he's going to have more pools. And I don't really have anything to compensate it with. Mm, he's, uh, and I also feel like he's tr trashed a little bit more. Can it be true? Um, I think so. Maybe I have a little bit more bones. But, uh, you know, just because of all the turns where I didn't buy the pool or something. So yeah, he only has three coppers, so he trashed four coppers. Means I have I have trashed three. 
I can now trash the potion too. That would be uh, preferable, but yes, uh, he ended up uh, getting six pools. Which, I mean, it's not the end of the world. It's just slightly unpleasant. Takes a village, I agree with that. Discard that, you can probably discard that. Um, hopefully gonna draw here eventually. Alright. Well, I'm killing quite a number of his... Uh, the last one might be a potion. Mm, I think it is a potion, so I'll just leave it there and trash it with the loan. Uh, what does it give me? I could use something like uh, Village Pawn. 3, 4, 5, or I can take gold. Gold is actually... You know, I ain't gonna... I gonna try the gold. There goes the potion. I mean, you could do something like village farmers market. It's just this first farmers market just ain't gonna do anything. I I think I gonna get the gold. All right, that and that's actually a fine draw. If he does not discard all my pools one by one. But actually, I've done that to his deck the last turn. So maybe he, he won't be able to draw all that nicely this turn. I've discarded, what, two of his pools. Well, pr he probably still has enough to draw everything, right? Mm, yeah. Should be able to, between the pools and the uh, rebel, found the village, so... So far, I only discarded one pool of mine. Let's see how here, rebels. If he's going to at all, because I'm not even I'm not even sure it is supposed to be good, right? Yeah. So he he, just, he decides not to. So he has only three pawns to my four, which is my only. Well, I guess yeah, my only uh, advantage is that I do have a uh, a pawn, an extra pawn, and I do have this gold. And I've trashed the potion. So I might be doing fine still. So this game ain't lost or anything. It's just, I mean, there is no denying that I am still behind, but uh, I have a chance here. For sure. I think gold is good here. Just because with so many buys. Uh, you need some economy. And farmer's market is terrible economy. Oh, hey, he goes for those. All right, I mean, mm, all right, let's see, let's see what comes. Discard that, discard that. Please just don't, uh, you know, don't do things to me. Um, that's doing things already. Where is where are my pools? Uh the last one is a gold, god damn it. Mm. Uh yeah, it sucks. So one of those is a pool. I think I'm still playing the loan though. 
Uh, all right. I can do pawn scepter. I mean, obviously the problem with the scepter is that it's, you know, it's terminal. Uh, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a treasure. You can draw it with a pool. Um, Piazza is completely useless, is it? Yeah. Just because, you know, uh, you're always gonna have some shit on top of the deck because of their pools and rebels. So, it might be a village pawn that gives me a little bit extra money the next turn. It could, I mean, it could be encampment pawn. How about that? It could be encampment uh, farmer's market. Oh. Oh, wait a second. That didn't work. All right. Whatever. I, whatever. <clears throat> this hand is just a little bit scary. Not the biggest deal. Uh, discards gold, interesting choice. turn where I, uh, you know, draw really nice. I think I, I can pretty much have uh, this turn anytime. I mean, uh, my deck is capable of it, I think. <laughs> and if I can have such a turn uh, where I, you know, use my pawns for uh, economy, not for just uh, card action, I I should be able to hit nine, I guess, with a couple of buys, get villages and farmers market, because I think that's how you do it here. Maybe I'm wrong. I think that's how you do it here with villages and farmers markets. I wonder if he's going to trigger here. Uh, yep, trash is another copper. Village. Two, I think, yeah, two villages and farmers market. That sounds fine. Discard that. I'll discard that for him. Come on, draw me a lot of action cards. Alright, that's something. Uh, discard. Ah, uh, damn it! That the last two are low. Oh, never mind. Gold is in the discard. All right. All right. That that was good. That was good. Okay. So we just do uh, that, I guess. Uh, wait a second. I I'm not sure. I want to do that. All right. So let's do Y coin for sure. Let's do action coin for sure. Yeah. Now, and another action coin for sure. And now think. Uh, so that's six, uh, nine, ten. I can do eleven, I can do twelve. I can do 11 with 4 buys. 12 is only 3 buys. Uh, I, 
don't think I need to play this farmer's market. Right. So it's uh um I uh, then again I don't I don't need the village, I'd rather get an encampment, right? With this gold is better. Yeah, sure. So encampment farmer's market could do a scepter how about that mm, I'm a little bit worried about the draw maybe just a pawn maybe just you know what maybe just an encampment doesn't increase my economy all the I mean what about another gold so he, uh, let's imagine he's playing both his farmers markets next turn so it's going to be he's gonna get two coins and then three coins so I'm gonna get four coins and I'm gonna get the points so that's good I don't really need another farmers market now could do a gold I think I like gold just you know don't do terrible things to me like that was a terrible thing I mean at least I don't have like two estates on top of the deck I, I mean maybe I maybe I do but uh, gold on top uh, he discarded that. All right, I'm quite thankful for that. discarded the pawn I mean honestly at this point it's not unclear to me whether discarding the pawn is good or not I think it's actually you might actually just leave those on top well I mean I don't know so what is it he discarded two of the pools already uh, yeah two pools and one in camp and so actually it might be bad Given that I do have a state on, I mean, it's yeah, it's rather sketchy. I'm, I might just be dead this very turn. You, you just reveal and put on the top of the deck with Piazza. So, yeah, Piazza just does nothing here, basically. I think getting an additional encampment was correct there the last turn because I, I kind of like draw. I won't really be able to trash any more of those coppers really. And uh, yeah, just slowly adding this extra draw is quite beneficial. Uh, we need to start uh, worrying about piles here because uh, we both have uh significant plus by potential and uh and the piles are low i wonder if it takes it takes the gold now and stuff because he he's he's not really in any danger of not drawing he has plenty of draw and he's thinner so I think he can definitely afford to take a gold maybe it's not 
Maybe at this point you just get the villages and farmers markets. Here is one, get some encampment, bone, and a scepter. All right, so he's uh, he's kind of getting ready to uh, to pile the next turn. That's what he's thinking about. Uh, let's discard that. Uh, sure, discard the rebel and damn it, damn it, that's not good. <laughs> Pretty bad actually. So uh, yeah, that's how that's how I'm going to lose this one. Mm, and can't do much about it. I think you play this farmer's market, it's just... Um, I mean, I guess I can take a prance. Uh, what did he get? I think he's uh, just... Well... I'm not sure he's gonna be able to... to get the rest of the markets, but he's likely to, I think. I think I need to take the prance or I just lose immediately. And obviously that's not what you would like to bottom deck and... Yeah, I mean, then again, I can't really complain because he does have this rebel, which is, you know, makes my life worse. And my deck is quite um, sensitive to his top deck attacks. So there is that. He's definitely drawing here again and uh, getting those farmer's markets points. Probably gets a prize. And I mean, thing is, he's just uh, at this point, he's, he has he just has more stuff, right? Uh, then again, if I if I manage to draw, which would be really nice to be honest, then uh, I might have I might even have more money just because I do have this gold. I'm pretty sure he takes the points here, and that's kind of obvious. And since he has, he has three farmers markets, right? Maybe he doesn't. Maybe actually he doesn't play any after the first one. Because um, he might just play the pawns terminally, and. Uh, um, I don't know, get the bronze and leave me with those uh, dull farmer's markets. Well, he also, he also has a scepter, right? So I guess he can play, he can get three farmer's markets, farmer's markets plays. I don't think he can pile here. Well, maybe he can do estates. Mm, probably not enough money. It's it's either not enough money or not enough buys. It must be close, but uh, I don't think he's quite there. He has six, uh, six pawns, I think, and uh, three farmer's markets and a scepter. So uh, he can... He can do the buys. 
he can do both money and buys I don't think so he goes for playing the markets he ain't gonna have the whole lot of money actually right Uh, that's it with the farmers markets here. His uh, all his economy is what he has two coppers left, so it's five, and then like six pawns is uh, six more, so it's like eleven, and then scepter is at max three more. So well, fourteen, fourteen, fourteen is. I mean, it's a considerable amount of money, obviously. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like, um, again, not um, not drawing to the to get this, you know, the last scry and pull and you know. So the again, I feel like the early draws were a, a little bit sad to me. Mm. Although this board definitely, you know. Maybe I've made plenty of mistakes here on the along the way. Can't you know? Can't really um, state otherwise. But uh, uh, I feel like I'm lacking draw here, and you know, that's uh, that's why I'm losing now. Because uh, I just uh, was not able to draw the deck the last couple of turns or something. So yeah, this takes a little bit of time for Lemon Spawn, because uh, surely you have a lot of ways to play your pawns. And given you also have a scepter and this whole pile situation, definitely quite some things to think of. Mm. Yeah, so you can turn he can't even pile the farmer's markets, actually. Unless I'm miscounting something. Mm, I'm miscounting the loan, so actually it was possible. Uh, yeah, it is, for, it is possible for him to, uh, to get 15. Yeah. But what is it? Bronze and what? Encampment. Dashi maybe. I mean, he doesn't need a dashi. Think silver. You got, I think you can sit take the silver. It's Yeah, I, I just uh, I feel like I, I pretty much need him to stall at this point and you know it might be not possible at all. It's coppers really Oh he wants to scalp this way. I mean alright. Um do I care about losing this encampment? Because if I do not I'd rather just play the encampment first because I Otherwise, I discard this copper into the shuffle, which sucks. Um, but I guess I do care about this encampment. Oh, f for fuck's sake. Uh, yeah, whatever. Uh, I mean, uh, I don't know. Uh, 
yeah, it's it's kind of hard to do it without uh, with only four pulls. It feels like feels like that was quite significant. All right. Yeah, I mean, I, I feel like this one was, uh, you know, you know, the the outcome had something to do with the draws <laughs> there. It's just, you know, um, it's not, uh, it's not good to think of the games this way, but it's whatever. Anyways, uh, what is it? Is it the game number? Five. I think it is a game number five. Let's look at the board. Mm. Yeah. Hopefully he doesn't have a five two or something. Uh, all right. Yeah, it is a third uh, game uh, with Chapel this match. I mean, you do get a chapel, right? There's no way around it, really. You could do... I mean... Fair is the only plus buy here, but it's probably... Uh, I mean, it's definitely worth it to build because of that, simply. And also, you can, you can dismantle... Mm. Chapel. Um, it goes Chapel Dismantle. I think I like that. Yeah. Ah, oh, fuck off! <laughs> like, what is, what is this terrible garbage? Oh my God, that. That is starting to get really annoying. I mean, uh, I don't know. I don't know. All right. Yeah, that's that's not you want what you want to see. The ideal draw would be to uh, get the chapel with two estates, two coppers, and then dismantle. I mean, you want to dismantle an estate here, obviously. You want the gold. But here, I'm. I mean, I'm not even sure. What can I do here? I'm not even sure I kill the copper. I I mean I guess I kill the copper and like buy silver. What are my options? I could do something like a con conclave is not terrible here because of cursed village. You want a fair at some point, and obviously now is not a good moment for it. Sacrifice isn't Terrible, but pro oh, well, actually, it probably is. Is not trash in a copper worth uh, conclave instead of silver? All right. I mean, it's fine. All right. It, it, Actually, I should stop complaining. His draw was worse. Ha ha ha. All right. Uh, now, though. So, down there is this stupid dismantle with the uh, two coppers. I think I'm just. Uh, <laughs> it's not going good. Uh, yeah, I'm keeping the state because I. 
want to kill it with this mantle. It feels pretty damn stupid. Alright. Uh, no. Do I want Conclave now or do I want Fair? Think about Fair. It would always suck to buy to spend a turn to to buy it. It's not only this turn. It feels stupid. It will always feel stupid. Uh, so maybe it is this turn. Do I really need the conclave the next turn? Let's go for fair. All right, that's that's actually a, a reasonable draw here. Come on, kill those. Yeah, the cursed village, a curse, whatever. I can live with that. Oh, you. Hmm. <clears throat> All right. What should I do here? Could kill a curse by conclave. Could kill. Uh, could turn gold into barrack. I mean, what? Uh, what is better? Uh, trash a curse, get a conclave, or keep the curse, get a paddock. Um, well, I think I'll get a conclave this turn, and maybe another dismantle the next turn. Uh, drawing the conclave here would be would have been really nice. Cause I think you you, you want a second dismantle. Um I don't really feel ahead now, but I do have this fair, which is something. Gets another gold. Uh, he probably gets a fair this turn. No. Um, gold into sewer. That's quite annoying. All right. He might even get a copper. Oh, I I guess that doesn't make the whole lot of sense. Alright, what is that going to be? I mean, it's either silver or copper, right? Which makes me question my internet connection. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean... The only consideration why you don't take a sewer is that maybe you you for some reason think you're gonna trash this oh hey it's a potion yeah oh damn it yep all right never mind i'm stupid potion yeah that makes sense all right conclave dismantle gold into another cursed village war did nothing to me i am invincible uh, should I get a paddock now? Should I get another cursed village? I feel like let's just get more of those. Envious, uh, slightly annoying, but not terminal, not not critical. Whatever, I should be fine. 
Is, so he's going to get all this junkin attack on me. But uh I think Chapel can deal with that rather handily. That that I believe does not hurt. Oh never mind. Oh uh, yeah, okay, it didn't. But his turn sucked, so it's all good. Um All right, now another cursed village. Yeah, I think so. I really want them. Uh, that did nothing to me. Um, well, uh, what is that? Anyways, right? Yeah. Oh, why the? Oh my God! I sc that was so stupid. I screwed it up. I, s I was supposed to get another dismantle there. I just, oh my god, that is, that is terrible. Yeah, I, I just, I just screwed up. Uh, yeah, that was pretty silly. Okay, uh, so I'm envious, which actually is quite annoying. Uh, so that's three. Uh, that's that's currently five. I could make it four and just get a dismantle. Yeah, let's keep the copper. Let's not have any extra junk. Just in case this single familiar kills me or something. I, I definitely underplayed this uh, last turn severely. I, uh, it was a pretty significant mistake. It might cost me uh, this game, actually. Because I could have been doing uh, much more. We still haven't seen the delusion. Yeah, he's playing. He's playing his uh, second dismantle before I can, and that's not the way it should have been. Uh, do I get a third dismantle? I wonder. I feel like it's there is time for that. Let's do it. I could do another gold here, how about that? And then I trash the copper and uh, curse, yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. So this is another cursed village. Bad omens. Oh no, not that, please. <laughs> Uh, should I kill the copper? How much money is that? Um, eight or nine? Nine looks slightly better to me. Uh, what's left down there? It might be a delusion. Which actually I don't care about, right? Because. I could just buy Browns. Uh, one, two, three, four. F Let's get this cursed village. Yeah, it is delusion, but um, yeah, I could just think I'm good. I think I'm just. I'm gonna green now. 
and I don't think this uh, oh actually you know what I what mistake I've made uh, the last turn I definitely should have been gaining a, a curse not a copper uh, when I dismantled my silver yep it's in my best interests but oh well so you kill the copper and the potion I think that means he ain't getting any more familiars gets a paddock which is obviously something that we're gonna get a lot uh, now Hmm. All right. He still doesn't have the fare. So I should, uh, I should be able to outscore him quite easily with the uh, double prawns, uh, which I'll eventually going to be able to get. Also, I wonder if conquest is actually something you you try to do here. I I don't think so, but it is definitely possible to get some value out of it with all the dismantles and um, you know you can get a if you if you get like three three at sewers at least during your turn and then you buy double conquest it's a lot of points. On the other hand, mm, mm, I don't know is it. Is it worth it? Might be worth it, actually. So you take three, say, well, you can even get like four sewers, right? Let's imagine you want to do that for some reason. Okay, you get four sewers, that's, f oh wow, he goes for all the dismantles. And gets the fair, all right. Ah, he's maybe thinking about the curse pile all right can i can i pilot here i don't um no i can't right if i just get all the curses um I, it's not possible right Yeah. Do I want to dismantle number five? Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Uh, that's still not good, but... Uh, no, actually, I can't do that. I should have been... Alright, I should have been... Uh, one, two, three. What is this goddamn garbage again? Alright, whatever. Mm, annoying. Okay. Um. Six freaking villages. I can I can draw I know. Alright. Okay, at least this looks good. Uh he's gonna give me a couple of curses again. I I can't care less. Cause Not like he's spider and actually this turn I might be able to pilot maybe 
Well, that would depend, I guess. Uh, the uh, last turn was quite annoying, to be honest. I could have been doing more than that, but my curse villages were just, uh, you know, cantrips, basically. Alright, this turn, I mean, it's supposed to be uh, quite good. Uh, Oh wow, he really wants to get all of those dismantles. Uh, I hope he... Actually, you know what, it's been it's been always me who can't draw. <laughs> uh, yeah, because... Um, actually, with having six dismantles and only four cursed was just... You have a chance of not drawing and this chance is not very small, actually. Mm. Oh really? What is he doing here exactly? Are you sure you can pull it off? So he's apparently he's he's thinking he can do it here because otherwise, I mean, what is what the hell is he doing? Ah. Uh, he would need to... <laughs> he would need to... Uh, trash all the curses. Trash... Well, I mean, so far it's only one curse, right? He would need to trash a curse. Or... In case he gets more curses than curses. With the... Uh, with his chapel and then uh, outscore me while also being miserable and um yeah i i'm not quite you know it's like there are three different things he needs to do here and i would i would think he should easily be able to do two of them but all three it seems hard. But he does have... Uh, he does have two more dismantles to play and he also has another... Uh, Barak, alright? So actually, he can... Uh, he can play all his terminals, um, potentially. Third terminal being a chapel. But... Uh, mm, I don't think he has, he has enough to pull it off. Yeah. Well, he still has to, he still has two uh, horses. Um, in hand him mm. we only have five golds between us I'm pretty sure I have at least two I think it's exactly two so he must have three uh, he doesn't have a sewer I don't think he does have he has any coppers so it's another barrack is 
four total plus three golds. Um, it's like 13. Mm, I mean, it doesn't make the whole lot of sense to try and count that because there are also dismantles. So let's just see what, what comes. Uh, his hand uh, right now is two golds, dismantle, chapel. And uh, two golds, dismantle, chapel. And uh, a horse. All right, he pulled off a tie. Uh, whatever, annoying. I I think I screwed it up. So I, I definitely, I mean, it was probably a, probably tie is good for him here because um, he he was supposed to lose this one, but definitely, I don't, uh, I'm not sure he it was possible for him. To, to win there or something but I definitely screwed up somewhere in the middle like the turn where I didn't just gain and play the second dismantle that was uh, pretty pretty stupid and the silliest part was that I intended to do that it's just I somehow uh, you know thought of something else and forgot about it whatever uh, so here's the last one um, Here's the here's the kingdom. So Druid apparently has plus card, plus buy, plus coin, and also the Earth Gift. Mm. This board, huh? Uh, it looks uh, it looks very terminal to me. Not a whole lot of uh, villages and and stuff. Mm -hmm. Well, you know where to find them, right? Uh, so, Gnopen, uh, Lookout, Black Market. I mean, what you can also try and maybe do is that... Maybe you just try and uh, go for something like Merchants, Governors without any additional messing around. What is this shit? I could do, you know what, here. I could do Squirrel, I could Squirrel here. Then next turn I gonna have seven coins. Mm. All right, at least I got this date. Do I want this dude? Gaining four and um, no, I mean not enough internal space won't allow me to do that all of those are not great let's just say just because you know eventually all of them is probably going to be good but not now hopefully well I mean he probably he probably has five here right judging by the that by the fact that he didn't buy anything the last turn, he had two states, so he must have five here. So he's probably just oh really a ship dog. Hmm. Okay. All right now. Uh. So ironworks. Ironworks is good. Because you want merchants. And you want merchants because you... They're very good with uh, for Triumphal Arch. Thing is, Ironworks is really... It's really awkward to buy it now, just because, you know... Uh, you could do Den of Sin otherwise. Which would be really nice. Hmm... 
Second lookout is also nice, but um, I don't think it's very important. Uh, should it be Dan? Damn it! Let's go with the Dan. Hopefully I find my lookout here. Nope, not today. Uh, Alright, that's, um, that's an easy festival, right? Uh, should I take a druid now? Just, you know, it could be a squirrel. Market and forum are both fine, but you probably still still prefer Den of Sin. <clears throat> yeah, all right. Let's try and trash. That's uh, that was a good lookout. I think I. Given it's such a great card, I think I should take another one. Mm, uh, that is obviously this fucking Gustin. So, a quarry, uh, him being able to find a quarry is scary. Well, he didn't buy one. He just gets it then, all right. Uh, should I just, should I just uh, squirrel here? No, I don't think so. Uh, Hamlet should be good <laughs> through this whole freaking game I'm always getting something that I can buy I'm always having two coins left <laughs> that's yeah whatever all right yeah. whatever mm. Finding a militia or something would be really nice. It's a governor. All right. So how about this inventor now? Uh, I think I just get a den. I mean, Inventor is, you know, it's a good card, but um, you don't really have any any force, really. Uh, merchants uh, suck, kind of. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's just... Uh, I don't think it's worth it. All right. Uh, and so far, my advantage is that he doesn't have any villages. And I have some. I have a couple. Also, Hamlet... Um, Hamlet could be quite useful to... Uh, to finish trashing here. Gives me a silver. Yeah, Governor goes nicely with his sheep sheepdog. Sylvia would have maybe been annoying, but but given uh, he still doesn't have any villages, I I hope I hope he stays like that <laughs> throughout this game. That would be nice. All 
I mean, it would be probably quite unpleasant uh, for him, but uh, this way, through uh, suffering and pain of my fellow uh, Dominion player and a very nice person, I would maybe achieve victory. Because usually that's the way it goes in this game. Uh, he might he might get a gesture, but I, I, I probably just take something like you know just a gar or maybe a den. He gets a silver. Ah, uh, whatever, whatever. I mean, I, I don't think it should matter. Uh, what am I doing here? Probably just playing black market and squirrel, discarding the lookout. All right. I mean, that must be a menagerie. It's such a good card. And I want a silver because I am. I should be able to start getting some merchants. Oh hey, he gonna have a villager. No, doesn't want to. Yeah, it looks quite grim for him right now, but then again, it's a black market game, things can happen. Like that's not good. Oh, f yeah, f I'm not happy about this one. Let's discard that. Ah, uh, what, what do you do even? Oh, it's plus one. I forgot it's plus one card. Oh my God! What did that? That was so stupid, I forgot the druid is plus one card. Mm, yeah. That, I, I just screwed up seriously again. I don't think I... Oh my god. I don't think I need to draw this uh, village now. I think I just... Uh, what else can we do? And well, I, I guess I can get a merchant with that. I should. I probably just uh, get a squirrel, so that maybe next turn I can draw something. Yeah. Um. Don't think I want another. Oh hey, now I don't have. A, oh my god, I'm. I'm. I'm not doing it right. I'm not thinking nicely here or something or at all I don't have a black market now yeah that was that was shitty I I'm probably going back behind now or something mm. hmm You know what? I'm I'm getting a black market just like that. Then you saved me. I mean, it's not like I'm drawing it this turn. Although I might, I guess it's not impossible. Hmm. Obviously, I would also like to have some of those governors. Mm. He kills his black market. He, he, he's, uh, he lost faith in the black market after not getting any villages. Uh, I just kill a copper rain. Yeah. Tra what the fuck is that? I, 
you could you could win just like that with the uh, you know just trashing all my uh, oh, for fuck's sake Uh, oh boy. I can't really can't really buy this wharf. It's <laughs> because now I uh, my only my only will is just Hamlet. Thank god it, he can trash it. Alright, I'm gonna buy that. I'm gonna get the garner yeah, like that. And now I I trash my silver as well. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's not. Well, I mean, he's going to give me a silver. Yeah. I mean, it's not like I have any merchants, right? What am What am I thinking about? Treasure the sewer gets Gar. I'll kill the copper steel. Yeah, Gar here is even. You. He's even better than usual just because you can't really take the whole lot of advantage out of the remodeling. Because um, you don't have any forest really. I. You know what? I think I should probably stop playing this lookout. It ain't good for me. Um, discard for action. Um, well, Luckies, and then what? And then I could do a merchant. Yeah, sure, let's go for that. Luckies is a good card, I heard. I I don't think I really need to squirrel this turn. I probably should be drawing quite easily here. Might uh, get a merchant out of the luckies. Might be better to kill the copper. I think I'll go for that anyway. Still have this hamlet to discard the coppers from the menagerie if I need to. Kill the copper. Oh my god, that is fucking killing me. Good news, and now I don't have a Willish anymore. <laughs> I don't have any terminals. Oh, that was the wrong order. Um, 
I can draw this gold now. How does it help me? I can get governor merchant. Uh, never mind. I can get two governors. Uh, I should probably do that. Yep. All right. So I ended up having what, like three? Uh, I mean, uh, four, four, five, right? Oh, never mind. Is it six? Um. Thank you. I don't want to trash. Really, you must be kidding me. You must be kidding me. <laughs> you know, it gives me points too, so... Oh my god. I don't know. I don't know. I I'm probably just uh, you know, probably I at some point I had the chance to uh, you know like stop uh, for a second and do something meaningful, but I did not. I don't know. Maybe I can do something this way, but um, he's likely to empty here. All right, I mean, well, he doesn't have any plus by really. He can't really tur turn stuff into merchants. So maybe he can't really pile the merchants and dance uh, that easily. But still, he's quite likely to just get the prices, even if he gets like three prices. I mean, what the hell am I supposed to do with that? Get some water. Well, maybe. With four governors only, he can't really get four provinces. I mean, I think on a good draw, it is pretty much possible for him. Uh, don't have any coppers in his states. Uh, it's it's hard for him to for me to estimate what's what's in his deck really. Like three provinces. Uh, I'm gonna trash here, sure. Uh, so it looks like he's going to settle on three provinces or okay three pro yeah I, I mean that must be enough right mm. let's go get some dashes uh, I mean He 
won't really be able to counter trash here, right? Yeah, so that's good at least. It's a gold out of Sylvia, and well, he can draw. Looks like it with the with the ship dog. It looks like he wants to trigger the. Ship dog can play it as a squirrel, but he can't because of the some interface issues. But yeah, I don't think it matters. Anyways. Looks like we found the bug here. Anyways, let's uh, see what I can draw. Uh, there is no way I'm trashing the merchants, right? I'm just playing the merchants. Um, no. I still have two gar two more governors uh, besides those two. Wonder how many silvers do I get? Do I have? Uh, how many points do I need to get? Like um, gold into bronze, silver into dashi is uh, nine, right? So I have thirty-six. Um. 36 so then oh uh, hey I can probably actually make it I just need to know what's going on with the merchant situation I think I need to draw here cards uh, that's merchant number four merchant number five Maybe this Hamlet play was a bit premature. No, I need to figure it out. So that's five merchants. Uh, did I have a clean shuffle? Uh, yeah. So I don't have five. So another one more merchant. One more merchant uh, gives me uh, three coin. Uh, three points. <clears throat> so what can I do uh, with those governors actually because the problem is I can't really <laughs> uh, I can't really trash the silver so okay I okay I do trash a gold into bronze right okay Druid could be plus buy plus coin. Uh, golden to bronze, that's what, that's like um, 33. And I need 10 more. 10 more could be. Um, Druid, uh, so. 10 more, and I have 3 buys. And 8 plus 5. 
uh, eight life uh, that looks like thirteen. So that's two dashes and Marin, that's nine more. Uh, that's that's a tie. But I, I also have two Garen, two more Garen in place, mm, which are sadly I think they are useless. Uh, what can I? What can I do? Uh, damn it! I think they're useless. I think I can only die here. Mm, yeah. Yep. All right. Looks like we uh, we got the server start. All right. Well, I mean that that's it. That's it, I guess. So oh, we ended up uh, getting two ties. So um, yeah, not the not the very best match for me. Mm, I felt like uh, I was screwed up with the draws in some games. In some games, I definitely made some mistakes. Uh, well, <laughs> anyway, I really liked the first game, so that was that. That one was good. Anyways, yeah, I guess thanks for watching and thanks for listening, and see you in the next one.